Hello YouTube, I'm TomBomb615, and welcome back once again to Retro Bowl. So, we're 8-2 and two of the year, we have 6 games left in our schedule, we're going to play the first 3 in this episode, we're going to play the Bears, the Seahawks, and the Rams, and hopefully we'll be continuing to expand our lead over Dallas for the, for the division lead. Our roster looks exactly the same, except for, for this game, our quarterback Feeney is going to be hurt. So I have no idea what we're going to do for that because our quarterback is probably going to be trash. So hopefully Chicago is not that good. Okay, so you can decide to rest people, and that's probably why Feeney got hurt. So Chicago has a, is 3-7 and seven on the year, has a pretty bad offense, but a very good defense. We saw the same thing with Dallas. Hopefully our defense can set up and, you know, step up unlike the Dallas game, but we still got the win. So let's see what happens. We start off with the ball. I, I'm very afraid of this no-name quarterback, because though Feeney is pretty bad... Oh, my. Oh, that was awful. Yeah, this is going to be a problem. Uh-oh. Very nice. All right. So the defense causes a turnover. <laughs> I... I, I... I can't run the ball because their defense is too good, but I can't throw the ball because my quarterback is off. There's Tioli. Yeah, Tioli is going to be a big receiving threat because I really can't do anything else, I don't think. I think that's Tioli again. Yep. Sims? Not going to happen. Sims again? There he is. Beat his man, and now he is headed for the races. 35 yards, wow. Let's see, Tuli again. Oh, wow! I meant to go to Tuli. Perfect. All right, defense breaks it up. We got great field possession and a great chance to score again before halftime. Sims, nope. Wow, because our defense is really doing a great job. Oh my goodness. It's so weird because it's throwing it way further than I like project it to. Yep. It just like goes further than you expect, so you have to throw it short. I believe that is pick number four on the game, if I'm not wrong. Are you joking? Okay, that one's off a tip. Okay. Defense makes another good stop. Catch it, Sims. Yes! I was ready to explode because that was an interception waiting to happen. Tioli. Very nice job. Oh, tight end beat him. He dropped it. I think that's pick number six. I think, yeah, the defense is worn out. The offense can't do anything. Let's see. They kick a field goal. It is good. So with a minute 48 left, we got to storm the field, get at least a field goal, and don't give them any time. So this game is getting a lot more intense than it needs to be. Are we not even going to get past midfield? <laughs> Tioli, please. Thank you. And double coverage. Okay, no names open. Go, buddy. Made a guy miss. Very well done. Okay. Going to run it to take some time off the clock. Sims. There he goes. Might have left a little too much time on the clock, but an extra point here will put us, will force them to go for the touchdown. There it is. Okay, so it's a four point lead, 25 seconds left. Uh oh. They go for the pass. Oh, it does it every time. And it comes down to the wire, but we pull out with the victory 14 to 10. There you go. Win a game without a star quarterback. 
We are now 9-2 and two and are tied for the top of the lead of the NFC. That is great. Kicker Marshall Morris had an outstanding game. He did. He did have a good game. Okay, so Darius had another great game, but his condition is very, very low, so we might need to rest him for the next game. Um, so we're going to have Feeney back, but Tioli had 78 yards, Hewitt had no catches, and Sims had 69 yards. Nice. One touchdown and two tackles. He caught Hassan Sims playing Retro Bowl on his phone during a team meeting. Praise him, because that's a good app. <laughs> Yeah, Seattle and L.A. are both so, so good. I don't think we should rest Darius for the Rams game because Seattle's an NFC team and the Rams are AFC. So I think it would be best off to play Darius here and just hope he doesn't get hurt and then rest him for L.A. I think L.A. will kind of be our rest game. So we start our own 20. Feeney is back and better than ever. And he finds Hewitt, who was catchless last game, but he gets 20 yards right off the bat. I'm going to go to Sims because it's a pretty throw-friendly outlook they have. Wow! There he goes. 37 yards for Sims. Oh, Feeney really starts off this game hot. Good blocks. Okay, no name. Good block from Sims, and he is gone. Touchdown to no name. And I missed my extra point. <laughs> I would much rather go for two anyway. So Seattle is going to probably pound us on the defense. But as I say that, they missed the field goal. Which gives us a good chance to go up two scores before the middle of the second quarter, which is great. He was open. Okay, I like Hewitt here. See, Hewitt looks good. Tiuli looks even better. No drops, no nothing. There goes Hewitt. Did not happen. Sims threw it a little too far. I think that was our first incompletion of the day. Well, Tiuli just flat out dropped that one. Um, I think we need to go to for a field goal here because it's just fourth and nine is not doable. Okay, come on, Morris. I need you here. Come on, buddy. Yes! That's the first time we got a... That's our longest field goal. Well done, Morris. Okay, Seattle doesn't score before halftime, which is good. But they get the ball back. Touchdown, Seattle. But we get a great return. And a great chance for Tiuli to go pick up a lot of yards here. Can't really ask for much better. Oh, no. That was a bad throw by me. I threw it a little too short, and I had a good read on it. Wow. Right, so it looks like we're going to give up the lead. Darius makes a great tackle to hold this field goal. And they missed the field goal. Isn't that their second missed field goal? So we got to be really smart about our plays here. I would say small chunks, just like that. Worst case scenario, we need a field goal at the worst. See, no name should be open. Okay, Sims is open. Very nice. Okay, Sims should be open again. There he is. Oh, makes a man miss. 30 yards puts us in field goal range. Tuli not having the greatest running game, but is helping us in the receiving game. Just like that. Wow. Okay, this would be a first down. I feel comfortable just running the clock out. I'm not going to throw the ball unless there's a great route. There we go. I'll go for the field goal just to make it look like it was a better game than it was, but... That's the end of the game. We win 12 to 7. Oh, and Tioli gets hurt. He'll be out for a game. Okay, so this is what I mean. Because I wanted to rest the guys for the Rams game, and I guess that's kind of an automatic rest game for Tioli because Tioli's hurt. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do after we play the Rams. 
Very nice. Cheryl's receives an award for helping the homeless. So the Rams, yep, are, are very good. <laughs> and we are only a two-star defense and a one-and-a-half-star offense. And the Rams are eight and four. So I completely expect to lose this game. No name. Very well done. Feeney and Hewitt on offense. Okay, well, that was more my fault. I'm not going to chalk that up to anything else. That was definitely my fault. So the Rams, I wouldn't be surprised if they scored every single drive. And as I say that, they punted away to us. So that's very nice. Guy who's supposed to be where Sims is. I don't even have a kicker either. I just forgot I benched the kicker. Oh, good job, Hewitt. Okay, well, we're not going to make the field goal because I benched the kicker. Running back. Oh. Touchdown Rams. Good catch. He's pretty fast. Oh, Hewitt. Nope. Picked off. All right, Feeney's having an awful game, and it's all because of me. Obviously, you need 10 yards for first down. And I missed the throw again. Let's see. Are they going to... Okay, they go for the field goal before half. 10 nothing at halftime. Basically exactly how I figured it would go. Okay, so we hold them to a field goal. And they miss it. Okay, I, I kind of need to go for it. Oh, he dropped it. That probably... Yep. I will take a moral victory here if we score on this drive. Like, anything. And I think we need to get in the red zone in order for our kicker to actually make his field goal. Good catch. Okay, I need I need Hewitt involved in every play, but they're not letting me... Oh. Get it, buddy. I want to hew it. This guy across the middle. Yeah! No name in the end zone. And he drops it. Very nice. All right, so we're at the goal line. I'll give it to you. Please. No! Oh, we got blanked by the Rams. On our rest day. We lost 17 nothing. And we lost a lot of fans. Wow. I mean, that was a pretty eventful episode, if you ask me. We got three more games left. But other than that... I think that's it. We're 10-3, and three and we're basically clinched our playoff spot. Next episode, we'll be preparing for the playoffs. So that is it for me. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you'd like more Retro Bowl, please be sure to leave a like down below. And of course, subscribe. But other than that, I'm TomBomb615. Have a great day, everyone.